Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Braidstone. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing you guys how to basically resolution scale on the Yuzu emulator. But before we get started this video, please make sure guys you like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's get it. Now, I know in the past that the Yuzu emulator had their own dedicated resolution scaling tab, but a few months back, they removed it. Due to the fact that um, the resolution scale did not work with every single game they had fully playable. But as I'm recording this video, uh, which is um, July 25th, 2021, there's a workaway around that. Now, I, I can say that it worked with certain games, but not every game. So don't be coming under the impression that this will work with every single game. This would, this um, resolution scale will work with certain games like um, it's basically a mod. It will, it will work for certain games like Breath of the Wild, Sword and Shield, and I believe Monster Hunter Generation and other um, ones. But it's from the GitHub um, mod page. So um, use this with caution, I would say, due to the fact don't be expecting every game will be basically playable. Like say for example, they have their own dedicated resolution mod for um, Breath of the Wild, which this one disables and makes the run um, run at 1080p resolution, which is pretty impressive. They have something for Link's Awakening, which is a blur mod to make the game looks much more better. And they also come with um, cheats, a Chico mod, which is kind of weird in my opinion. But um, I think the most notable one you can um, play with in 4K is monster hunter generation ultimate and i believe in also with rise they have a, a mod for that if i'm not mistaken see 4k um resolution for um ultimate and i believe it's for rise also so basically and also you can use the 60 fps mod which is i say the 60 fps mod works with 90 percent of the games if i'm not mistaken and also, I have the 4K mod um, in the description down below, so make sure you guys check that out. I'm going to download it right now. Minimize it. Drag and drop it. I'll leave the links to both of these, the GitHub and the uh, 4K mod. And basically how this is basically going to work is you're going to open it. Drag and drop the folder onto your desktop. Oh, I didn't do that right. I don't know if it's gonna work off the rip, so I'm gonna make a, a new um, folder. It's called 4K mod. Just in case if the user emulator doesn't read it off the bat of mod data location. This is drag and drop with the EXF right now. And then go to properties. It doesn't read it, so that means it has to be enabled through the the folder so I'm gonna drag and drop in this folder and I'm gonna drag and drop it back again left click properties boom 4k mod press ok and then when the configuration settings go to the graphics tab uh, I'll disable this for now go to the advanced tab I'll use this the shared uh, the shader building and I basically press OK and then I basically play the game. Now this is very game dependent so don't be expecting this will work with every game so because it, it, it won't. And also you need a really strong PC like say for example you need something with the latest graphics card like the 3060s or 2080s of your NVIDIA graphics card don't be expecting you having a, something like a 1080 or a 1060 or anything below that expecting you playing games in 4k that's not how it works that's just the reality of it so that's basically it if you guys enjoyed this video feel free to like share and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out